Number four, if D is between A and B. Okay, so if it's between it, that means the points are pretty much collinear. So we have this line segment. We have A and B, and we have D between them. Who knows where D is? We'll just put him right there. Doesn't mean he's in the middle. He's not a midpoint. He's just on the line. They're collinear, all in a straight line together. Now it says, so what do we know? I don't even need to look at what it says. I'm going to say, hey, I'm going to use the idea of what's called segment addition. This segment added to this other segment piece is going to add up to what? The whole segment, the distance from A to B. Now, what do they tell us? They say, hey, AD, this piece is two. That's its length. And BD or DB, same thing as four. So what is AB? Well, that was a pretty easy question. AB must be six. Okay, let's see if the next one's just as easy. If D is between A and B, so same thing. We have A to B with D somewhere between them. So we know, let's always start with that, this segment addition, AD is distance plus this segment, D to B, adds up to the whole distance A to B. Now, AB, it says, is 24. And it says AD is one and a half. So it wants us to find B to D or DB. They're the same thing. Distance from B to D is the same as D to B. So what do I do? I'm going to subtract one and a half from both sides. And I'm going to get B to D is 22 and a half centimeters is what I'm guessing, whatever unit I wanted, but it's 22.5 units.